All right, we started week two, day eight today. It was all about a LinkedIn. So <laughs> maybe you're like me and you created a LinkedIn account when you went to university because your professor suggested it. That's my case because <laughs> I studied um, business management, international business management. And one of the tasks was, yeah, to create a LinkedIn kind of, um, account, connect, and I did all that and I hadn't really used it since then, mostly because I, yeah, I've been working at English schools and it was enough to just like submit a regular CV most of the times. So my LinkedIn profile was quite up to date. I had tweaked it over the years a little bit here and there, but yeah, it's definitely good to have a look at it again to create your professional online presence. And yes, um, I noticed how I felt quite vulnerable and quite scared when I updated my headline into the billboard message that we created a few days ago, like when I basically told people on my profile that I am a business English trainer and um, people can come and work with me. It felt like a very vulnerable uh, moment somehow. It felt like putting myself out there into the world because last week we were working on this challenge at home behind our computer and not really, yeah, telling anyone except for me on this, like through this, right? But yeah, so I overcame the fear. I decided that it's okay if other people see that I'm working on this, right? It's because I asked myself, why am I feeling so vulnerable? And it was more the fear of other people who know me seeing this and yeah, noticing what I'm doing. And then I thought, but why do I feel hesitant to share that? Why am I not proud of admitting that I am, yeah, self-employed business English trainer. And yes, so I just did it. And let's see where else that will take us. It's uh, going to be a right of you. Also, one thing I did learn today was that you can translate your profile, which was somewhat new to me. I had had that in the back of my mind, but it's actually really cool that now you can create your LinkedIn profile in another language. So I'm going to be working on my German profile as well. 